Right, we've done a thousand miles on this already, but I know a lot of you have asked the question since I put the video out about the ceramic coating. Um, I've just cleaned this, and it's just taken me about 20, 25 minutes to clean the van. Um, it just makes it so much easier. The dirt just falls off the van, but also the way the beads, the way the water beads on the van. Have a look at this. Get close in here, Lynn. So that's why we had a ceramic coating. Um, just makes it so much easier to clean the van. Okay, another quick upgrade I'm gonna do to the van is to put some mirror covers on because they will protect the, uh, the mirrors. Um, and I've been in some tricky situations before where I've clipped another car or another car's clipped me coming the other way and with the mirror covers on it's protected them. So I've gone for the Malenko ones, which is the same van on the last few vans. Um, really, really easy to pop on. There you go, just clip on like that. Then you've got a little bit, cut the screws in there um, and that will hold it on tight as. And there you go, two minutes later, both fitted. Right, I've gone for white ones, they do black ones as well. And I think they look a bit cheap, the black ones. And the white ones are gonna stand out to other motorists so they'll be able to see them as I come along. Uh, right, you guys probably know about these. If you don't, I'm gonna put a link in the description um, so you can get a pair of these. I think they're about 60 quid. Right, we're going to do a bit of shopping, but first stop, drop these off for subscribers. Don't show their address. I wasn't, I was making <laughs> sure I wasn't. Gosh, there were some interesting uh, smells in there. <laughs> okay, it's the uh, end of a day, isn't it, really? Four o'clock. I was popping to work oh, because some right people. we've had something delivered at work. Have we? We've had a parcel delivered at work, I want to grab. Do you know what it is? Yep. Is it something that's going to get me excited as well? Kind of. You're lying, aren't you? It's for the motorhome. Huh? Yeah, maybe. Right, this game work. Hey ho! So I've got loads of Sikaflex. These are for the solar panels and stuff like that. So I've got five tubes of Sikaflex. But more importantly, okay. I got a new set for toilet. So we've got a spare cassette. I can't tell if that's in focus or not because I've not put my glasses on. <laughs> He's just a speck. <laughs> you know you should be wearing your glasses, but there you are. It's only to be excited. We've got a new toilet cassette. Yay! Exciting. You're we might last more than two nights. Two nights is all we get really at the minute. Ikea? Let's go to Ikea. <laughs> my dad used to work in an office in the 80s that had furniture just like that. It's right through a brat. Oh, they could have tidied up behind them. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, honey, you're hungry. Oh, cakes. Display. Oh. Cakes. Don't get the ideas of a new kitchen now. I'll do for a few years yet. No, it, it's it's reaching the end of its few years. We've been saying that for quite a long time. <laughs> yeah, we just bought a new camper van instead. The kitchen can wait. I've not found the right place for my knives yet, so we are going to get a magnetic strip, some fancy hooks, and because we can, some new knives. A, I don't think the ones we've got will look very nice on the... On the <laughs> that's rubbish, isn't it? I'm sure they're well balanced and very sharp. It's not all about looks. Sucker hooks for the shower. These are really handy for the dressing gowns and for the coats, actually, as well. I know we've got the pull-down um, rack thing, but I think you can never have too many. Comfy? I want the reading corner for the, for the garden. It's not uncomfy. It actually is quite comfy. Yeah, sit down. Yeah, it is comfy, isn't it? It is surprisingly comfy. Yeah, right. How much has it been? I don't know. You think you're down the bottom it's, of the garden? It's, yeah. Buy me olive tree. And my pots of lavender and rosemary. Oh dear, this looks like it's an expensive visit to Ikea. Can we look at this another time? Before my birthday. Okay. I do like a good route around the bargain corner. <laughs> <laughs> what do we need a desk for? We don't, but it's bargain. <laughs> <laughs> Magneted to it. Go outdoors, not been here for ages. What's the map? Tell me where you park it. Do we need one? No. We've got a Roman Redford's one, right? Yeah. Oh, look, they've got our 
two cook pro deluxe uh -huh. it's our favorite uh, hob to be cooking on guys should we get a little tent to go with it love look at this this is huge technically that's got more room than a massive nine meter motorhome if we needed a tent i'd go for something like that but we're not allowed a tent we've already got tents right and the boys love using it in the garden here you go love collapsible buckets and collapsible utility colander and a washing up bowl why are all washing up bowls now rectangular my sink is round i need a bowl to go in my sink that collapses down or is not very deep but can be deep and is round and is round i guess we can't get a bowl here not here no where to next decathlon across the road hmm they didn't have much stocking when we was in there the other day maybe they've restocked since it's across the road, let's have a look. Otherwise, let's go to the range. Yes, the range never fails. Love decathlon, but they're nowhere near the size of the European ones. They're amazing. No, sure, European ones are much better. Maybe it's being reset. If we was in Europe, I mean, they'd have stock, right? They must have been switching from but the camping winter section. to spring. They're still a bit scarce. No luck. No luck. We're next. We're going to go to Aldi next because I've seen in all the Facebook groups that they've got loads of camping bits and pieces in. So you never know. How long you had your car now? Six weeks. And? I love my car. It's gorgeous, isn't it's it? My car. <laughs> Mine. You can tell this was built during the COVID era. It's brand new. It's got a stop and start light above the door, built in. We don't need pegs. Pet bed? No, nah, definitely don't need a pet bed. Stranger Things cushion? Yeah, uh, maybe. Oh, no luck, my love. So the range. Last hope. But it was my first instinct, my first hope. And it's just across the road. We should have come here first. Is that what you're saying? Only if we get it. <laughs> if we can't get one, then no. Dun, dun, dun. I told you so. You'll like it because it's white and grey. Yeah, it goes with the van. That'll do for now. Let's get it. Yeah, exactly. Right, let's get this van packed up and on the road. Mister, oh, she goes to go outdoors. All right. Well, you'd think that's the place to go, wouldn't you? You would. But I know, just the range has got everything. We've come downstairs and they've got better sticky mat than the upstairs one. Steve didn't like the colours of the upstairs, but this is actually a lot thicker as well. 5 99 for one and a half metres, so it's more expensive too, but... It looks much more efficient though, it much does. It's chunkier. Much better. Let's get it. One? Yes. Do you think we need more? Maybe for the boys' table to put the muggies on. Get two. I feel really smug now. It's like the range has got everything. And I knew we should come to the range and Steve was like, no, 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 let's go to go outdoors. All right, all right. <laughs>